Well, my name's Richard. I'm Barking Driver. I've uh, been driving for 15 years now. So um, to be nominated for Bus Driver of the Year was very good. Um, I was nervous at first. I got a message on the screen to see the garage manager. Um, and then a letter came through that I've been nominated and it's all going through. My name's Sarah. I've been working with Arriva for 10 years at Wood Green Garage and I really enjoy my job. The route I drive is 184s. I heard about the Driver of the Year via my manager. Uh, really looking forward to it. I've uh, been nominated because of um, mystery travellers, um, good re reports via them um, and say so looking forward to the experience of today. Hi there, my name is uh, John and uh, I work for Reeve. I've been working for Reeve for near enough three years now. I work at the Pondes and Garage and I drive the, uh, the Route 279. I found out that I've been uh, nominated to be a Bus of the Year competition uh, via my line manager Chris Berry and uh, I feel very honoured to, to enter the competition and to be nominated as well. My name's Sarah, I drive out of Palmer's Green Garage on the Route 329. My garage manager Dave approached me and said that he's putting me through for Driver of the Year which was a bit of a shock and I'm here today getting ready to do my thing. Uh, it was really good. I was really nervous at the beginning. Uh, it went through better than I thought. Uh, excitable, but scared. But I think I've done alright, and I think, fingers crossed, I might be in with an opportunity. But if I'm not, it was a great experience, and hopefully, I'll be back next year to do better. I, it was tough, um, very, very nervous because I was the last one to, to take part, but I think we did all right. I think we did all right, yeah, quietly confident to get in maybe the top 10, hopefully. <laughs> I'd be happy with number 10. I think the most difficult bit was getting it in the green box. Uh, it was about three inches gap that you had to get the back of the bus into the box, and that was definitely the hardest bit. So next year, if I'm asked to do it again, definitely. The answer is definitely yes, it was fantastic. Right, in reverse, I'm only going to do the top three. Everyone's a winner, but three have, three of you have, have outperformed the rest. But to be honest, looking at the marks or the penalty points, they're fairly close. So, in third place, we have Noel Law from Clapton. <laughs> Second place, we head south to Darren Kelly from Croydon. Well done. Well done. Well, we obviously, we have a winner um, by a few points, which is, uh, but it's as I say, it's all very close. But the winner is Steve Truman from Watford. Well done, Carson. I'll get it. How about that? <laughs> and finally, finally, we have a young man somewhere by the name of Adam. Where's Adam? Come up here, Adam. Come and stand on here. Actually, we should all stood on here. We'll have to do that afterwards, won't we? Adam, come and stand right in the middle. This young man is nine, am I right? Yeah. Adam. Adam has, I think for more than one year, been a marshal for this event and I think that's pretty impressive for a nine-year-old with all of the, you with all of you guys all adults and the challenges and Adam has done that and that's great for a nine-year-old who should be on no you're not on school holidays yet are you no, no soon so anyway 
Adam, I think we want to recognise you, and it's really good because we have we have two things. I don't know what you're like more. <laughs> you're going to get them. Yeah. <laughs> Look, there's some, there you are, Adam, some chocolates, and we've got a bus driver of the year medal because I think you deserve that as well. So look, you stand there. I'll shake you. Can, I'll shake your hand. Well done, Adam.